From the studio, Kimberly Davis, ABC Columbia Digital, trending headlines today, Monday, January 30th, 2017. President Donald Trump's travel ban has left one Clemson University PhD graduate caught up in the aftermath of the controversy that has sparked worldwide protests. The order signed Friday immediately suspends immigration from seven predominantly Muslim countries in the Middle East and Africa. Nizani Zanori left South Carolina last week to visit her family in Iran and is stuck in Dubai after being denied entry to the U.S. Tweets from South Carolina Senators Lindsey Graham and Tim Scott say they are working to assist her. Plus, West Columbia police are looking for two suspects accused of robbing the TD Bank, located in the 1900 block of Augusta Road at gunpoint. According to police, the suspects were wearing gray hoodies, black masks, and gloves, and fled in a white and color four-door Volkswagen Jetta with black and red paper tags. If you know who these suspects are, contact Crime Stoppers, the number 1-888-CRIME-SC. And an alleged burglar is in the hospital after jumping from a second-story apartment window. Richland County deputies say 48-year-old Bruce Davis jumped from the window after breaking into another apartment located in the 7600 block of Hunt Club Road minutes earlier. Davis is charged with two counts of first-degree burglary and will be transported to the Alvin S. Glenn Detention Center when he is released. Join us tonight for the news at 6 and 11. Kimberly Davis, ABC Columbia Digital.